Hello and welcome to the Daily Comic and Collectible, episode 191. Now today, the collectible of the day is the Hasbro Toys Star Wars The Force Awakens Black Titanium Series Darth Vader and Stormtrooper Die Cast Helmets. Darth Vader, once a heroic Jedi Knight, was seduced by the dark side of the Force and became a Sith Lord and led the Empire's eradication of the Jedi Order. The Stormtrooper, equipped with the sleek armor and powerful weapons, enforced the will of Darth Vader and the dark side. Recreate the biggest battles and missions in the Star Wars saga with helmets from the Black Series. With exquisite features and decoration, this series embodies the quality and realism Star Wars correct collectors love. This two-pack of die-cast helmets stand two inches in height and are equipped with adjustable logo embossed clear stands, released in 2016 by Hasbro Toys. Now the comic of the day is Darth Vader, number 18, with the publication date of March 2016. This is part of the third series arc titled The Shoe to Run War. Story by Kieran Gillen, art by Salvador LaRocca, and cover by Care Andrews. It is currently a time of chaos for the Empire after the destruction of the Death Star, and Vader is showing no mercy to any rebel sympathizers. In order to regain allegiance from the ore rich planet Shutoran, Vader has assassinated the royal family and cast the throne to its youngest surviving daughter, the new Queen Trios. Despite the deadly warning, rebel acts continue requiring further reprimand. Elsewhere, Vader's secret ally, Dr. Aphra, has fallen into the hands of the rebels, and he has put a bounty on her head, dead or alive. Ooh. Meanwhile, Shu Turin has banded together to fight back against Vader's attacks. The planet's rebels have sabotaged Vader's combat drill, and it has veered off target into the lower mantle. Princess Trios fears that Lord Vader is doomed. In the drill's command center, a stormtrooper informs Vader the drill has hit solid rock, and they have lost propulsion, and are now surrounded by Rubix's soldiers. Vader, realizing it's a trap, activates the siege defense, and the combat drill releases its laser cannons on the enemy troops. When Vader hears that the Imperial Guard have been told to call off the attack, Vader demands them to hold their ground while he takes care of the enemy. Dr. Silo urges Queen Trios to call off the attack, but she will not, without Vader's orders. Queen Trios challenges Chancellor's decision to call off the attack and pulls a blaster pistol from her side and demands him to reverse his decision. The Chancellor believes she won't pull the trigger, and she agrees, then orders a soldier to kill the traitor, and Trios orders her troops to war. The battle is continued in the next issue. Geek Fact This issue takes place after Star Wars A New Hope, dated as Zero BBY, standing for Before the Battle of Yavin, and just prior to the assault on the Makota space docks in 1ABY, which stands for After the Battle of Yavin. So this issue occurs between 0 and 1ABY. Plus, in case you're collecting this 2015 run of Darth Vader, it has 25 total issues. There is also a 2017 and a 2020 ongoing current run. Final Geek Fact. I chose this issue because I had to match it with the helmets for the cover. That geek fact goes out to Trev. Well, I'd like to thank y'all for joining me for today's Daily Comic and Collectible, and I can't wait to see you again tomorrow. This is Cat Fan Comics Man, and I'll catch you on the flip. Over and out.